motion to approve or consider phase two subdivision. Seems like everything that has answered um, at this point, I would, I would think that we can move ahead with the motion. DJ, do you think everything's in well in order? Yeah, I think there's an important dis dis piece to distinguish here is that it appears to us that this application is for pre preliminary subdivision approval mm -hmm. um, with the understanding that the developers are ultimately going to come back to the board um, for final subdivision approval, um, you know, with an application that meets all of the requirements outlined in the subdivision and land development ordinance for the township. So what's um, the difference between preliminary and final for what they want to do? I mean, essentially, you know, it's the same. Usually we do them concurrently. I wasn't sure if union allows tentative and final together, but I mean, really nothing. We'd go through the process twice or once. That just seems silly for us to go through it twice. That's why, you know, what's the difference that they would need to A lot of times those preliminary differences only, it, it's a good advantage to the contractor, the developer, because if he can now say, okay, I've got a preliminary approval, I can go borrow the money or do whatever. Basically, yeah. the difference. And this one <laughs> is a little different because we've been through PRD and final and tentative land development already. It's just been so long since we got everything approved. You have to have your subdivision approved within 90 days of your approvals. And mm. obviously, that hasn't happened. So we have to go back through the process to meet that requirement. Yeah, so uh, Union Township Subdivision Code Section 242-26 outlines the final application submissions for a major subdivision development. So it's like Brian mentioned, it's it's a lot of carryover. It's, you know, it's a similar process to work through preliminary versus final, but there are differences and there are additional pieces of information that are required for a final application. So at this point, it's my understanding that we would be considering preliminary approval at tonight's meeting. So with that in mind, to answer your question directly, with that in mind, we, our office does not have a problem making that recommendation for approval tonight. For preliminary. For preliminary, preliminary. correct. Um, so you're motioning? Yep, I'm going to motion to approve the preliminary. So it's, you're going to make a motion to recommend the Board of Supervisors that they... We don't get to make any 